Hello everyone, this is David from Gold Star Tool and today we have a Kansai Special FBX1104PR. It's a four needle chain stitch waistband machine, cylinder bed with puller. Right here you got the puller in the back. Great, great sewing machine. Uh, it's, um, you know, if you've seen the waistband, obviously, um, and when you want to do the top of the waistband, this is the sewing machine that everybody uses. Very heavy duty, it's made for denim jeans like this or lighter, but in uh, um, heavier stuff. Um, I like a lot of, um, uh, I want to say correctional facilities use this machine and uh, they use it in their sewing rooms. But uh, it's made in Japan. Uh, concept is one of the good things, among other things that is good about concept is that it's made in Japan. It's still made in Japan. Um, where are the stuff? All right. So here are the accessories. So just to show you guys, this is how it's gonna be. Two and two, four needle, and look at the back, beauty, chain stitch. And if you look at here, you're gonna have eight thread, four for the top, four the bottom, four the looper, and look at this beautiful orange that is sitting here. Um, and um, four needle, now the gate could be also changed. You could have one inch in the middle or three quarter in the middle. Uh, these people wanted quarter, one quarter and you also have from the side obviously whatever sky is the limit what you want but the one is quarter one quarter so that's how we made it it's a beautiful machine again it there's the oil pump when you buy the machine there's the oil goes right here the whole entire oil and we already put the oil in there um there is a gauge here the machine is not direct drive, meaning it has an external motor underneath. It's a brushless external motor. Um, speed up, speed down. We kept it at 3,000. Um, pretty much a great, great, great sewing machine. The customer wanted this to be top mount, another fully submerged, even though you could have a fully submerged, but we haven't done it. Okay, so let me just start, and then we're gonna go get back to the detail. Okay. This is a, obviously a more heavy duty machine, so you will hear some noises from the puller back here. There is a very nice turret puller back here. There is a reservoir here if you're gonna put silicone oil in there that you could um, obviously, you put silicone oil here for sewing aids that when the, th the thread goes through, it really, really helps the sewing. Okay, so it's gonna do it faster because as you're gonna see, we're gonna, we're gonna be sewing very fast. Um, this is a, right here is a bracket with all these screws that whenever you need to buy or order custom made folders for this machine. These are the place that you could put it. Even this one comes out, but here, this is, I'm gonna put this back for you guys to see. Look at these loopers. This is how everything is done. The thread, these are four lower thread, obviously how beautiful. And the top one are four loopers. So the chain is, is the idea is that you don't run out of thread, lower thread. Just keep going and going and going and going. FBX 1104, 04 stands for four thread. PR is um, puller, PR stands for puller. Can't say people, if I make a mistake, I don't know, correct me, but PR should stand for puller. Very nice, beautiful. So let's go ahead again. We have a bunch of stuff that it comes in the book and I have no idea what it is. It's, um, I just don't know. Uh, could be for the installation of the sewing machine if you wanted to install some other way. Of oilers, um, some screwdriver, needle is DVX57. And you see size 21, really heavy stuff. Got some grease, some oil, owner's manuals, cover, and the rest. Here we go, let me just start. There is a food lifter right here, chain that will bring up the food. 
and here we go. Voila! Voila! Look at that. Look at this. Now, one of the threads came out. I have to, it came out before too, but I have to see why. See, when you pull it, oh yeah, see, it's very, see, I just wanna tell you guys that whenever you see a thread, see, like right now, this thread is breaking. <coughs> and one of the reason is, see, I'm trying to pull and it's not coming. And it's right here that it's getting, see? now it's coming, you see? Sometimes you have to make sure your threads are sitting right or the tension. Make sure the tension is not very high. It's good that this thing happens while, this is my glasses, I think, very nice. Damn Do we have the hair here? Here we go. Back there, so let's, I'm gonna pull this in. Let me pull this out. Very simple. So I had a problem with this. See, again, it's happening. If, Lindsay, if you could show up in the top, see, when you wanna pull, you see in the back there, it's very important. I tell people sometimes they don't believe me that when you want it, even that, see right now it's getting, it's from the, all you have to do is like lower the bracket. So that it, the thread comes easier. All right, so now I'm gonna, I already fit the tension a little bit, let's see. Let's see. Uh, this shouldn't happen to a brand new machine, meaning that. Um, okay. Let's see. Four needle. Eight thread chain stitch. Let's see. I'm gonna go to the side here. Again, so this is certainly there is a problem with the rider, but you get the idea. Let me just bring you here. This is two needle, quarter inch, one inch space, and quarter inch. Make sure your threads are threaded right. Not only threaded right, make sure the tension is right, make sure the setup is right. Make sure that sometimes if the thread is really big, you could always go with the smaller corner thread. This is, it happens all day long that I have customers call me. I mean, besides they tell me, complain to me that they cannot find the needle hole, which is not my fault. But I have a lot of complaints that the thread keep breaking. It's all the tension. You see all of this thing here? Lefty, loosey, righty, tidy. Losing the tension, play with the tension. It depends and it makes a lot of difference what type of fabric, what type of thread, what type of needle you're using. For something like this, you need less tension because it's thicker, right? And you gotta make sure like sometimes the thread going through like here, if you see you need more tension, instead of putting it through one, you could take one loop and pull it through the other one. All of these things makes a lot of difference. The way that this thread is makes different. The way the, way the thread stand is uh, uh, set up. But if, overall, a great machine by Kansai with the pulley, if you wanna show the back. And here is the actual beauty. Right there from goldstartool.com. Obviously Kansai makes it. We distribute the goodies and we're happy. It's on a, uh, on a regular K-Legs. Again, brushless motor, um, and top setup, and um, beauty. Thank you for watching, and let me know what type of sewing machine you want me to make a video of for, and uh, like, thumbs up, and have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful time.